Hello, and welcome back to my playthrough of Crash Bandicoot. And just before I start, I've got to say, I made it all the way to Slippery Climb. I got the whole hog gem and the high road gem. And I basically, uh, a glitch happened in uh, Slippery Climb, I restarted it. The uh, gameplay crashed, and as you know, usually I would just split into two parts, but the uh, recording also got corrupted, where it just couldn't be accessed or anything. That's the first time that's happened when it's crashed. So yeah, you'll just see me completing the levels twice, well, completing Whole Hog and the High Road uh, without dying and getting all the boxes, even though I've got the gem, just to show it off. Because if I managed to do it last time, I should manage to do it this time. So yeah, hopefully you don't mind. Um, the level isn't too bad overall. I did it in one go, like I did um, Hog Time, so hopefully I can do that again. Um, that would be pretty awesome if I could do it in one go again. And yeah, it's left, 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 right, 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 that's the pattern. I remember. Did it, did it. So that's the last left, and the rest are right. Even that one, it doesn't look like it's right, but it is. Yeah, that does look like a scary jump, that one, that you're going to die on, but you don't, which is good. There we are. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. So yeah, that's perfect, or at least it would have been. Um, so yeah, now I'm going to fight Pinstripe, then do the high road, and then um, do what I would have done, which is Slippery Climb, so yeah, as you can see. I got that far, but never mind. Um, I'll just show off these two levels. Yeah, because I got a glitch where uh, I jumped onto one of the arches, because um, you have like two arches that you have to uh, jump into to hit a few boxes and you have to jump back onto the platforms. But the moving platform like clipped me, I hit it and it pushed me inside the wall as a glitch, but nah. I guess it's a good thing I didn't do it now because otherwise, yeah, never mind. Things happen. Yeah, Pinstripe, as I, I think I said, um, I think he is an awesome boss. He's my favourite. Yes, he's an easy boss to deal with, but he's got a gun, man. I mean, what can you not like? He's a corporate potteroo. He probably is the easiest boss in the game. Nearly had a glitch then and all. Jesus. That'd be bad. Pow! There we go. Thumbs up! If you can see it, there we go. So yeah, now it's time to do the high road and then it's back to the slippery climb of slipperiness. Whatever you want to call it. Um, so yeah, uh, this isn't going to be fun. So yeah, to start off with, no, that is not what you do. That is not what you do at all. I jumped way too early. I don't know why I did that. Never mind. I think I did this first time, actually. Um, but that doesn't matter, because I find this a bit easier than the first one. Because I don't really mind the turtle jumps. I don't find them too hard. Um, but everybody has their own strengths and weaknesses in games. It's like I have different strengths to probably most people. I could probably do something that most people can't do, but not do something that most people probably can do. Because I cannot overcomplicate things, as you know. Um, so the only time, well, the only way I probably will die is if I hit a turtle that's moving like that by accident, by being an absolute utter wally. Um, but yeah, as I said, I don't think turtle jumps are too bad. But yeah, I won't be doing the bonus stage because I already got that. Um, but yeah, it's just, yep, yeah, that's an example of dying there. God, I'm not going to be able to show off the gem now, am I? Never mind, I'll, I'll try again. 
I'll try once more and I'll just go through the level to show it off because, yeah, I'm not happy with it. Um, this That's why I didn't do two videos on Friday because um, I was doing it and it was like, I started, I think, just before 10 at night. And it cut, I think I got that half an hour through because Slippery Climb took me ages to like try and do. Um, but yeah, I guess I might be able to save time though because I might be able to do Slippery Climb quicker than I did before. I don't know. We'll see. I just have to be careful, make sure I don't swim in it, the turtles, man. I don't want to actually hit them. Yeah, I don't usually find this level too bad, as I said. <laughs> but finding it hard than what I did last time, which is a big shame. Obviously, sometimes you don't have to do big jumps, but whatever floats your boat, I guess. Um, you don't need it there. Screw you, Hog. I'm not going for a hog ride now. I've done both the levels on you, you son of a bitch. Yeah, I, I, I usually don't do the two hog levels in one go, but I find the second hog level slightly easier than the first one. I don't know why, it's just like this. I find this slightly easier than the first of these type of levels. Right, I know there's something up here because I remember getting it um, last time. But yeah, I'm actually doing this on Saturday. I'm thinking about whether I want to do something different where I do one Pokemon Crystal and one Crash. And then I eventually um, like do that every week. No! I, I, I'm just going to go through it. I'm just going to go through it. I'm not going to show off getting the... Well, I, don't, I can't show off getting the gem itself. I was right near the end anyway, but yeah, I did do it first try, but never mind. I'll just, I'll just get through it. I'll just get through it. So yeah, I did that, I think, I think it was first go. Maybe yesterday I did it in second go, I don't actually properly remember. Yeah, this is as far as I got. So I think I made it around this time as well. So yeah, you can imagine, 23 minutes in trying to do this level. But yeah, as soon as I get to the first checkpoint, if I die after I reach that point, I'm just going to leave it and get the pink gem another time. Because there's no point in messing around. Um, but there is only one checkpoint that you can get uh, regarding, uh, well, I'm discarding the embryo bonus stage. Um, but yeah, that's, there's two counting that, but there's only one really that most people will get, um, well no, I think most people will get both of them, there's not, I don't think everybody will do embryo, I don't know, I don't actually know, most people probably go for the bonus stages, but I actually managed to do the bonus stage, it's quite an annoying bonus stage to be fair, but it, it's not compulsory, but it might be made compulsory in the End Saint Trilogy, I know, i said this before, I know I do, uh, Mention the insane trilogy a lot, but it's literally is around the corner now, um, and it's just less than two weeks away. Um, it was two weeks on on the Friday. I actually was originally going to do this video. I'll wait for the cycle. Right, it should be a good cycle as soon as I get up. I think I have died on that pink spike up there before. That's catastrophic. Um, that's not a good cycle. There's like so many glitches you can get on this level, like clipping into stuff, it's just so annoying. And this is one of the harder jumps of the game. Nah, I'm fine now. I don't want to jump too close to the wall. Oh dear. Right, so yeah, if I die from now, 
I'll just accept the death and just go through it normally. But wow, I've actually got here first time. That's actually pretty impressive for me. Because, yeah, most people think Slippery Climb is the hardest uh, original Crash Bandicoot level. Um, I ain't begging to differ. N no way, man. I'll say if I manage to do this first try, it'll be lucky or I actually have got much better than what I was uh, a few years ago when I got it on the PS3 and when I was younger, but obviously you do surely you'd get better when you're younger anyway, but I don't know. It just depends if you take up gaming as something you want to do in your life quite a lot. Um, the more you play, usually, the better you get, but it, it's not always the case. Oh dear, I am having trouble dealing with this. Right, ten minutes so far, right, that's too close to the blooming edge. Right, this isn't the best cycle in the world. That's a good cycle. Right, I'm not getting a good cycle on these jumps. I don't like these cycles. There we go. I picked myself back up again after the trip. Holy crap, holy crap, holy crap. <gasps> holy crap, that was nearly a death. Even if it takes me a couple of minutes extra to actually do it first go, I guess it's better than having multiple attempts going back to the first living checkpoint. Go. I didn't want to mess that up then. Like, jumps like this, I don't like. I absolutely hate these jumps. Nope, that was bad. No! What? Are you kidding me? No! No, 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 That was... I jump... Why... I just don't get why I'm getting bad cycles, that's just not good. I actually did better than that on the ending... Oh, I'll get the pink gem off here, it'll be fine, it'll be fine. Shouldn't take me too long to get it, if I got that far in one go. Um, but yeah, that was... they were horrible cycles. Wow, look how quick I've done this now. Now I've no... I've already died. Heat's off. Look how easy this is, look, look how easy that was. And I stuffed it. I stuffed it real good, man. I'm still going to do bonus stage, because why not? Yeah, some of these jumps are like the harder in the hardest in the level. Um, right. There's a bonus stage, so it acts as another checkpoint. Uh, so yeah, hopefully this will be the only level that I do in this episode of which I'll be uh, doing for a second time. So yeah, this is what I did last time. Um, it does seem like it's hard, but it's not too bad if you blew me and take it slow. It's just about relaxation, keeping it calm. Anyway, ooga booga! But yeah, it talked about Insane Trilogy. If you've like seen some gameplay and like what and trailers and whatnot, um, I'm gonna practice with this jump. But yeah, uh, post a comment about your thoughts on the graphics, gameplay, voiceovers. Like the voices, if you think the voice actors are just as good or even better than the originals. Um, I think they've done a good job as Vivi, or Vicarious Visions as you might know them as. But I can't quite think of what games they've done, but they ring a bell, so please tell me if you know. Um, because they do sound familiar. Um, then again, it might be a really popular game that I have played many times, but I just can't think of it. So yeah, that bit there, that arch, is where I got the glitch. And it is where I have died many times on this level. And yeah, look how close it actually is to the end. Crap, 
you son of a bitch. Right, just do the level. And there we go. Oh, Jesus, that level. Right, so now it's time for... I think Doors of Darkness. Yes. Oh no, lights out first. Um, you can't do this yet, you need the yellow. And you get the purple, so it's the only level of which you need a coloured gem for it. Uh, but you need to get a coloured gem to get the coloured gem. If you get what I meant, that I made that sound very confusing. So this level actually isn't too bad to do without dying. It's the second one, Fumbling in the Dark. Which is the more annoying one. Um, so yeah, if you get hit, you basically lose your Aku Aku. And it's no longer light. Um, so yeah. Oh god, oh god. <sighs> deary, deary, dear. Took that a bit too slow, but never mind. See, that's what happens if you take it too slow. It doesn't matter if I die, it doesn't matter. Not now, anyway. Um, crap. Right, I know it doesn't matter if I die, but not too many times. Oh god. Not too many times. Do, 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 do. It depends how good I get of a cycle of these platforms. Right, go, 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 and do not stop. Do not stop. Do not stop. Don't really need to get anything else, it's fine. The Jaws of Darkness might be hard to do in one go, I know. I need to remember not to spin a certain snake because it stops me from getting the cortex head. I need to try and do the cortex thing as well. Which might be annoying. Um... that sword stops swinging. So yeah, this is the actual final checkpoint. There's no more boxes from this point because um, that yellow gem takes you up somewhere and then you get the three boxes and that is actually the end of the level. Um, well, there is another ending platform thing. But yeah, this is the actual end of the level. I remember this being the end. So there we go. It isn't the hardest level to do. Um, when you need to do it, but yeah, I've only missed out on Slippery so far, so now it's time for Jaws of Darkness, um, I hope I can do this well, well hopefully, so yeah, thumbs up, I'll keep quiet because I've got a feeling it'll give me trouble, yes, comment if the Saturday, because I don't know if I'm going to upload this on the Saturday night, I'm thinking about it, but yeah, comment if the Saturday for you has been a mighty fine hot day. It has over in good old Britain. I knew that would work, but yeah, I should have gave myself time to just walk across it. Never mind. So yeah, it's been a mighty fine hot day. Please comment down below. Well, you don't have to. I'm not gonna like beg for like comments and subs. You just do all that stuff if you really think. I am good enough, I mean, I'm not going to say no more, I don't know if I'm good or not. Why judge yourself when you've got others to judge you for you? Don't mean that in a negative way though, viewers. I'm just saying. Dun dun. Oh, what? Oh, it went down before I... Oh, okay, I'll do it this intended way, go in the middle one. Jump up when it comes back up. I'll do it that way, if I have to. That's fine. That's fine. I just thought I'd be clever, but it didn't work. So there we go. What's the time? Not even 20 minutes and I'm at Jaws. And then I think it's either Embryo, then Castle Machinery, or Castle Machinery, then Embryo. But I'm going to leave Castle Machinery for now. Because uh, you can basically skip the whole level by going on two green gems. You get crap tons of lives for it as well. Um, but yeah, that will all become clear anyway. Do, do. Do 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 right, So I, I think I can remember where the snake is that does that, but I'll try and do it without dying. Um, because I, I want to try and get the, g the gem and the key at the same time, but we'll see, we'll see. So yeah, this is the last, second and final gem that you can get in the game. So there's only two secret levels. Just like there is in uh, 
two, but there's five in three. Three in the kind of secret warp room, slash bonus, and actual two secret levels that you have to actually find a legitimate secret for. And I think they're pretty clever secrets as well. And that's these spikes I need to be careful of. I think I'm near the first checkpoint, so if I die after that checkpoint, I'll just carry on either way. So here is the first cortex thing. So some people will probably just jump on the uh, TNT, which will stop you from getting the cortex thing completely. So yeah, two of the boxes you do find the cortex head in have been completely... Uh, shall we say debunked? Well, not debunked, but um, kind of like a trick. Trick or trap. Where if you uh, do a certain something, it will stop you from getting the head. I think it's a very clever way of dealing with it, but... Hidden? Yep. I know how this stupid game works. I don't want to grab the Aku Aku. Oh no. Hell no. Dude, no, no, no. Because I've got a feeling it might make this bit harder. I don't know. Um, but yeah. Because I think um, when you like got three Aku Aku masks, it does make your jumping and stuff a bit harder to deal with. But it makes you faster and invulnerable. So it is good for most things. But some things it's a downside for. But I like how they haven't made something too overpowered. Because obviously if you fall to your death. Are still dead. I don't know if there was another one up there, but obviously must have not have been. But yeah, these gem bits, I just don't like them gem bits. I don't know why. There's only one more gem, I think. There we go. Is this it after these? Yep. Let's just safely jump onto that, then jump across, do that, jump here. So just gotta go straight away. I think you gotta go straight away here, yeah, yep, you do. I think I'm relatively close to the end. Um which is pretty good. Yeah, it doesn't seem like it because I've only got one torn face thing and one cortex face thing, but you'll see. This is where there we go. So here's a cortex head. So yeah, if you spin the snake, it will hit that TNT, so it's a perfectly placed trolley TNT. Is this where you get the secret things? Yes, it is. Crap. Right, let's see if I can do this first go. If I can, then groovy. If not, then never mind. <laughs> Oh, do you know what? Oh no, he still went. He just fell through anyway. Crap. Oh, that's going to be hard. Oh dear, dear, dear. It's not the gem in this level that's the problem. It's the blooming cortex thing. Crap. That's actually going to give me trouble. Oh dear, I'm not looking forward to that. So if I don't fall for some disorientating jump. I think I'm near the end. Yes, I am near the end. I think I'm near the end. Come on, just get the gem, Adam. Get the gem. And if I get the gem, the key, I don't think really matters. Um, but yeah, that'll mean I've never shown off a gem. A uh, key. But never mind. What the hell was that? I'm an idiot. Never mind. Just ignore me. Just ignore me completely. What the hell was that? What's the time? 24 minutes. That's not too bad, actually. Um... I'd say I don't mess up now because, yeah, I've got no Aku Aku. Is this the actual end? It might actually be the end. <gasps> it is, it is, it is, it is, it is. Don't move any. I don't like this. I do not like that one bit. I don't like that one bit. What's the pattern, man? I've just got to go for it. Yes, you do. Thank God, I got the gem. I got the gem. I got the gem. I got the gem. That's the gem, isn't it? That's the gem. Give me the gem. Give me the gem. 
Yes, good. That's the gem at least. That is the gem. Oh dear. That's half the gems got. Um, I'll try and get the second key. If oh my god, I f yeah, I forgot that. Right. Um, I'll keep that one. Yeah, eighty percent. Wow. Um, it's quite, I'll keep that sixty-nine percent one, um, just in case something else happens. So yeah, now I've just got to get the key in uh, uh, Jaws of Darkness and the pink gem in Slippery Climb, and I think that's the only thing I really need to get. So yeah, look at this, beautiful. Just skip the whole blooming level out. <laughs> Do 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 Lights out, get the uh, gem there, and then I'll see what else I can do for now. So this battle, I don't know if it'll be hard or not. Wait for him to jump, wait for the green blob to jump close, and I'll throw these pink bottles. It does look like it's going to throw another green one there, but yeah. Never mind. Oh dear, that's not good. I never lose you die in embryo, but I might die here. Never mind. If I get well, if these three green blobs are killed, I should be fine because the final phase isn't hard as long as you don't miss some jumps and stuff. Oh dear. Oh dear. Ah, oh, you can do that at least. I forgot you can do that. Idiot, spin and jump and like that. Well, you have to jump. Yeah, I think you have to be at least above them. I'll do it like that then. <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah, I don't usually die on embryo. I might have died once. But yeah, embryo's like the mastermind behind everything. He's like the one who's like helped out on everything. So we final throws of the pink bottles and now he literally, literally turns into literal hulk um drops here didn't it oh no it's dropped down here and then you have to go on this side jump oh nearly got on there then and bash as you can see not too bad um but yeah it's been pretty good so far i've just missed out on the key and a gem um, that's pretty, in that's pretty good, to be fair. Um, so now it's the lab. Don't like this level. Really don't. Uh, you don't get a Akawaku mask, which is fine, really. But you do get three Torna things near enough straight away, which is pretty good. There we go. Now you get these yellow blobs. There we go. Just like the green ones. So this is the final level you can get a gem on. And it's where you get the yellow gem. There's a nice little troll in this level. Right here where there's a TNT poking out there. I don't actually think you ever get a uh, Aku Aku mask in this level. I know you get these electric things. But yeah. Here is the bonus around do. Oh, that doesn't seem like too bad of a ba bonus round, never mind. What's the percentage? 81. Eh. That's fair enough. Um. As you can see, 29, this is the 30th, Great always the 31st, kind of, and Cortex is the 37th, 32nd. But I might actually get the normal ending this episode, I don't know. 
doesn't matter when I do that really. That's actually the legitimate ending the ending that is put in place for two. So yeah. These are easy once they've been electrified. Uh, well, once you hit them, they electrify. And then you can hit them near enough straight afterwards. Yellow blob. Not as much. Just have to jump then. Do, do, do. Easy, easy to deal with. Um, all that uh, blew up the TNT, which is pretty handy. Crap. No! I'll get through the level for now and then I'll carry on another time. But yes, the ending to this level is so, so stupid. I hate it. So much. I mean, I don't usually find it difficult, but in recent years, like ever since I got it on the PS3, it's just been so much harder than what it usually is. Than what I, well, what I usually use to find it. And time that wrong. It's just that, that one. And then there's a bit afterwards. That's quite annoying to get past. Bitch. No, no, no. Stay back. Stay back. There we go. Stay back. And then go. There we go. Let's see. As long as I get through the level for now and then get the yellow gem afterwards, I should be fine. Now go away, yellow blobs. God. Alright, the yellow blobs won't come back, which is good. Just jump. I think there's a, a bit more. I think there's one final jump. And this is the bit I hate uh, in this level. I know you can get there. What? Ah, oh, I see, I see, I see. Right, do you know what? I am going to get an Aku Aku mask in Lights Out, because that might help. You might say it's cheating, but yeah, I don't want to waste too much time trying to do this. I actually do want to get the yellow gem so I can come back to this level. Uh, and get the purple gem, and then the only gem to get then is the pink, and then I have to go back through the rest of the levels. But obviously, I still need to also get the key, um, which will be a problem. Anyway, let's just do the lab now. Hopefully, I don't lose it on that electric man. But see, it won't save me from falling into a bottomless pit, which is the only problem. Crap. Really, I'll do you know what I'm still gonna try it. Might as well still try it. There's no point giving up, just got got hit. Alright, now, no, I didn't want to do something careless then, but I thought I'd be safe doing it there. God, come on, I don't want to do bad now. I've done so well up to now, and now it's crashing and burning. Where's a good place to get Aku Aku masks? I don't know. Oh, I know where. I know where. Toxic waste. Ho ho ho! I'll get golden Aku Aku. Because you know what? I don't care. I want to actually get through the level just so I can uh, show it off. Well, show getting the yellow gem off, and then yeah, and that go back through everything after I've done it. <laughs> there we go. So thumbs up. This should be enough. If it isn't, I'll know why. Obviously, if I fall in a bottomless, bleh, bottomless pit, bottomless pit, that there's no save. What is? It? Yeah, there's no save from there. You just die. Um, yeah, I can't believe I'm struggling on the lab of all levels. I even got past slippery climb quicker than this. I mean, what was it like? I made it to the checkpoint in one go. I just died a few times after that. And that was it. This level isn't really hard. I mean, you just have to be careful. No, don't miss boxes, man. Douche. Don't forget to jump either. God. How stupid of you.
Right. That's one of the uh, kind of annoying parts of this level done. Just got electrifying to do. Oh, it's surely, truly electrifying. But yeah, I'll, I'll, I can do it without an Aku Aku mask, but yeah, I'm kind of a, in a push for time. Well, not really, but I just want to at least get the main levels all done. That was, that was too close. But that, I didn't like that, that was way too close. Oh god, I don't like this jump. Wow, why they do this to me? Bitch. Oh, oh, oh. Whoa. Ooh. Peepity pop. Don't blame me falling in the bottomless pit now, Alan. Come on, you can do this. Recovery. It's all about the recovery. It's all about the recovery phase. All about the recovery phase. In sports, it's always about the recovery phase. Oh, you son of a bitch. I thought it was the thing that... Oh, screw you then. It's actually a... Uh, in terms of difficulty, I'll say it's mediocre. Um, uh, there we go. Is that, oh, great. So that should be everything. Thumbs up. Yeah. That's the yellow gem got. So now, I can go back to the lights out. Get the purple. I think it's purple. Is it pink? Is it slippery that's purple and lights out that's pink? I don't remember. No, I think it's purple that you get lights out for. And yeah, um, once I've done lights out, um, I'll, I'll go back to do a few of the earlier levels, uh, might as well. Do you know what? I'll just do the great all now. Basically, once you've got all 26 gems, you can go across the gem route. But yeah, this is literally all you have to do. So this is basically a level for the 100% ending. So yeah. Um... Yeah, I don't think there are many levels that you need purple gem for. I think it's only Boulder Dash. Anyway, let's do Lights Out All Out. Doodly 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 doodly. Yeah, at least with the when you're trying to get the key, you can afford to die. Um, yeah, fumbling in the dark is one of the levels that is really hard to do. Um, in case, well, in, I think it is anyway, but we'll see. But at least you don't have to do like the last third of this level because you get lifted up before then. Yeah, this, these can blooming really waste time, these stupid things, but I'll take it by my stride. I don't actually know the time it, does, it can last for, but that's dangerous, way too dangerous, man. Oh, that was too close. Ah, it's dimmering. It's dimmering. Oh, good. Thank goodness for that. I think I'm near the end of this bit. I think it's just a checkpoint bit to go. I think this is the final box. Just have to get to the yellow gem. Crap. Never mind. It's fine. It's fine. It's not the hardest of levels, I nearly made it, but I'll keep doing them for now. I mean, I haven't really had to keep quiet, to be fair. I've done well, even whilst talking. Um, so it proves it's, you don't all, I, well, I, I don't always have to shut up. But I need to remember the secret bit at the beginning of the level of fumbling in the dark, because you can go backwards, and I think you get a few lives and a few Aku Aku boxes, and then, yeah. Unless it's just all Aku Aku. I think it might be four Aku Akus or two Aku Akus and two lives. <laughs> oh god, it's going to start dimmering any second now. Here we go. Starting to dimmer. Thank blooming god for that. Oh my god. Ugh. Bad cycles. 
it's down to my error, but I need to I mean, try and make one cycle everything because yeah, it's not good. If you don't one cycle everything, it makes things harder. If you don't know what one cycle is, it's basically where you do something fast enough so that when you do something, the cycle is near enough perfect and it comes exactly when you want it to. Uh, Speedrunners try and one cycle stuff. Um, and then you get the frame things as well. Um, that uh, YouTubers try and do, but yeah, here is the secret bit. I'm not going to move just in case you can fall off the yellow gem. Yeah, I like that shadowy effect on these three boxes. It's pretty sick. Jesus Christ, what's going to happen then? But yeah, thumbs up. Ta da! So that is the purple, I think. Dun 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 dun. Yep the purple. So 11 more gems and one key. Getting there slowly. Um, I might as well just do a few more levels while I'm here. Um, and then yeah. What do I want to do now? I'll, I might as well go all the way right back to the beginning. Um, do every level that doesn't need a pink. I'll do Boulder Dash as well. well. I might as well do it while I'm here, so thumbs up. I've got an Aku Aku as well in case uh, the ending bit, well, the secret bit, kind of uh, be the douche because I know you get a few of these plants in them. So yeah, now I'm just. The rest of this playthrough is just going to be me going back through levels to get some gems. I might miss out Cortex Power and maybe whatever the uh, bridge level is and they'll be the only two I'll do off air and then I'll just do like a short final part of me doing the Cortex ending and the 100% ending but we'll see how it goes well it depends how bad I find fumbling in the dark really and yeah at the beginning well, if I do do a short, like, ending video, if I have to, I, like, start from Insanity and just go through every level to show you that I've got everything. It's like a little trick. There we go. Anyway, I'll keep quiet for this final bit. I don't want to die. I am satisfied. I am your friend. Scanning probability of death. Probability is high. We're likely to die. I can't really do a good load of bot impression, but wow. I'll see my... Go check out my brother, I know I said that before, but he's pl currently playing through Tales from Borderlands. That is an awesome game. Um, but wow, that's actually... Telltale games are awesome. I would recommend playing Telltale games with us. I'm going to see if, how many Telltale games I can get. I didn't know if you could reach high enough without jumping on it, so yeah. No! That's not good. Oh no, there's nothing up there, which is good. Yeah, I like how you get loads of lives. I didn't miss any boxes, did I? I don't know. Did I? Yeah, there we go. Uh, that is Boulder Dash done. I can't do uh, whatever the bridge level's called, road something. I don't remember. Um, so I might as well go back to the first island. There's only ten levels left to get a gem on. Wow, this could be done in four parts. I am so happy. Um, I've done so well this episode. And I've got the two native levels to do. I know you need pink for the uh, second one. The Great Gate I know you can do. Um, Road to Nowhere, there we go. I don't know why I forgot what that was called. Native Fortress, you can go screw yourself for now. Um, Rolling Stones, what does that need? That needs blue, doesn't it? Oh, I might as well do this. Um, 
get most of them out of the way now. Um, because, yeah. I'm going to need to. So, yeah, I might, I might make the finale 4A and 4B, because it looks like they're both going to be short at this rate. Do, 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 do. I'm sure there's also a secret box, like, hidden somewhere in this level. I don't know. We'll see. Unless I've already gone past it, I don't know. Booga booga! So I don't know if there's any more embryo things. Might be in the middle, I don't know. Never mind, don't need Aku Aku anyway. Yeah, I might as well do the two rolling levels of this game. I mean, might as well. I'm not going to miss much by not doing it. Um, yeah, as I said, I don't know if I've missed like a secret box or something. Because I'm sure there is. On this level somewhere. Um, for some reason, didn't hit them, but that's fine. I'll just take that thing there. I'll take it. Right, here is the uh, blue AGM. Right. Back up we go. Don't want to glitch through the gem. I actually want to be on the gem because it might cause a death. Actually, that jump seems a bit annoying. Wow, I've got no Aku Aku's left now though. That's actually pretty bad. Oh God. I hope I've got everything. I oh, don't know. Let's see. Might have missed something. Oh, now I've got everything good. So that is Rolling Stones done. Upstream, I know you need Orange 4, so I might as well do that as well. I think that's the next level, isn't it? Um, I'm going to go to the beginning. I might as well do it that way. Um, I'll leave the two native levels for now. Well, I might do. Because I don't really like those levels that much. They're annoying. Um... They're actually pretty early in the game as well. Which just uh, makes it even worse. Right, upstream. I'll do upstream and then the other rolling level. The upstream I should be fine with. We'll see though. I mean, it's not the hardest, harder of the two, but getting all the boxes might be a hard thing. We'll see. Whilst I burp my way to victory. Well, it's not exactly burping, but... Yeah, too much detail, I know. Piwana, piwana, oh, screw, screw, screw job, never mind. Well, I'm getting hit a lot in these early levels. It's because I'm used to doing certain things in the later levels, but never mind. Oh, I could have got that cycle then, never mind. 72 lives is a pretty hefty amount now, I will say. Um, yeah, all I need is the pink gem and the key, and I should be fine. Um, and yeah, after that, nothing much else to do. Right, here's the orange gem bit. Right, yeah, that's... God, I didn't know if he could just jump straight from there. Yeah, the orange gem bit wants to be a douche. Never mind. I'll leave upstream for now, actually. I'll go right down to whatever it's called. Jungle Rollers. There we are. Thumbs up. So I think you can do Great Gate. Um, I might do it, as I said. But, yeah. Dun, dun, dun. Or is it this level with the secret? I don't know. Well, whatever it is, I'm going to make sure I don't forget it. Ooh, and he's not on the second level. That would have been bad. But yeah, I love having this amount of lives. It just makes me feel good. Yeah, that's probably why they made it easier to gain lives, because obviously you can't keep your lives once you leave the, leave the game and whatnot.
Yeah, this isn't overall this isn't too bad, just doing that, that, and that. See if I can do the rest of this level without getting it. Actually, yeah, I shouldn't have said that, because I probably jinxed it now, I don't know. Nah, well, I jinxed it, never mind. Near the end now, which is good. It is good to know, it is very refreshing to the mind. You know, I'm near the end. Whoop! Kapow! Right, so that should be another one done. There we go. Eight more gems after this and it's done. Wow. Thumbs up. Ba -ba -ba. So yeah, I, I might do Great Gate next and then that will where it will be ending. Yeah, Slippery will be the only... Well, should be the only gem I won't get on air, but then again, Cortex Power is a bitch. So yeah, this is the final thing I'll be doing this episode. At the Great Gate. I'll hopefully be doing, anyway. But yeah, I nearly, I probably, if it wasn't for like the half an hour to 40 minute time loss and everything, I could have got it done in three episodes. But yeah, wow, come on. Stop being a wally. Stop being a wally, Crash Bandicoot. Is that how Coco would like it? Would like to see her brother be an absolute idiot, even though she's not in the first one? <laughs> so I don't know if there's... No, they can't be, because... They kind of can't get up there, I don't think. Oh, I know what you need to do for that. You need uh, Super Aku Aku for something. I remember. I remember. You have to go on the bounce up the box and it hits it. Um, so yeah, you kind of need Super Aku Aku in this level. I just remembered that. Uh, wow, I can't believe I nearly forgot about that. Oh, what are you doing, Adam? Oh, what are you doing, Adam? Ah, I am the one, the one who don't need a gun to get respect. There we go. Knew it. Shibbity wop wop do we shibbity wop wop shibbity wop. But yeah, I don't remember how long this level is. I don't think it really matters to, for now. Anyway, super aku aku again. Crap, I did exactly what I did first time I did this level. Do you know what, I'm going to leave it for now then. Because um, why not? I'll do uh, upstream, might as well. I'll do the two thingy levels. Um, hang on, so you've got the two native levels. Uh, you've got Road to Nowhere, Cortex Power, Fumbling in the Dark and Castle Machinery. Basically got seven levels left if I do this. Um, but I'll only be showing six of them because well, I'll be getting the slippery gem off here. So yeah, there's only six left. Well, there should only be six left when I come back. You see, when I come back, I'll need the pink to finish it off. But yeah, it's just the orange bit in this area that's just annoying. Um, never mind. But yeah, I don't know if you actually do need the Akawaku thing to do that thing in the Great Gate, but it does help. Crap, that, I knew that would kill me. God, that was bad. I knew as soon as I got it, it would bounce me too far. Because these stream levels, like when you get hit up in the air, it's just hard to tell where you'll be. Well, kind of. I'll keep stem so I get it done. I do want to do this one, uh, this uh, episode. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. 
Right, now I want now I want to get through it quick, so because I don't want it to reach the hour mark, but now so that's why I'm doing the things you spin and jump at the same time for some reason it didn't work. Never mind. I'll keep still still though. I'll keep still still. It's kind of a tongue twister. I keep still still. There we go. Oh, what? That usually works. Oh, you see, I'm trying some things so I can get through it quickly and it's not working. So I'll just have to do it normally then, the way this is going. Why is upstream giving me trouble? I died less times in slippery climb, man. Jesus Christ. Then again, I still haven't got the gem for that, so... Yeah, uh, I guess. It's invalid to say that. Right, I'm catching up with the amount of deaths I had in Road to Nowhere, though. I mean, that, most of them were unnecessary. Oh, crap. I forgot you can't. Do it if you do that, God's sake. It'd be good if uh, the no death thing reset if you don't make it to the first checkpoint, that would be really useful. But it doesn't. Well, I don't actually know, actually, to be fair. Um, but yeah. Anyway. Anyway. Wait for go. I just need to get this done. And there'll be nothing else to do. Apart from the two native levels, as I said, Road to Nowhere, uh, Cortex Power, Castle Machinery, and Fumbling in the Dark. As I said, I should be able to do Slippery, well, get the Slippery Pink Gem before I start the final part, or at least like the first half of the final part, in a sense. Like the final, final part should be short. Oh wow, it was that easy, really? I hope that's only that one for now. I know you get two on the bit beyond near the end of the level, um, but yeah. Because obviously I'm now like the pro of Crash Bandicoot because of like all the levels I've been doing. I can afford to do some risks as I know I should be able to do them. That was an unnecessary jump. Never mind. Oh god, I forgot that that was a leaf that was going to move. Never mind. For some reason I don't like jumps to the left or to the right. I just don't know why. Crap. Oh. Right, yeah, that's the, that's the three that like said, but you missed three boxes. Oh wow, this cycle is bad. Um, oh crap! Oh no, that's a good cycle. That's a good cycle. Come on, make it to the end. There we go. That's it. That's the money. That's the money. Here comes the money. Who do money talks? So yeah, that's going to be 19 gems. When I come back, I should have 20 gems and two keys. Hopefully. Um, so yeah, there we go. Oh god, that was a bad voice crack. <clears throat> but yeah, Cortex Power would probably just give me the biggest trouble just because of the platforming bit. So yeah, um, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the final episode, because it should be the final episode, so you've just got um, the Great Gate, Native Fortress, Road to Nowhere, Cortex Power, Slippery Road, which I'll do off there, as I said, Fumbling in the Dark, and Castle Machinery. I think that's the ones. See so yeah, until then, goodbye, thumbs up, and good night.